اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم I want to explain a simple way for doing Rukya for illness or Ta'weez as it's called um, Rukya or Ta'weez means to recite Quran and blow on somebody who's ill or on your own hands and then wipe with your hands the affected parts or just from your head down towards the, your legs on your body this is the Sunnah of Muhammad وسلم, and his Sahaba and is not writing down Quran on a piece of paper and hanging it on your neck or another part of your body that is not the Sunnah the Sunnah is to recite it and blow either on the body directly or on the hands and then wipe it over the body or to blow onto some water and drink or wash with that water or to blow on some oil and massage with that oil um, there are different types of Rukya there is ones for illness, ones for protection from the jinn and the shaitan and there is ones for protection from or cure for black magic today I want to talk about the simple Rukya for illness if your children are ill or yourself or another person is ill then you can do this simple Rukya you need to recite Ayatul Kursi one time and then you say Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim and recite Surah Ikhlas three times then say Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim and recite Surah Surah Falak three times saying Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim in between each recitation and then you say Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim and you recite Surah An-Nas this is the last Surah of the Quran three times remembering to say Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim in between each recitation you then say the short dua Bismillahi arkik wa Allahu yashfik you only say, need to say this dua once I'll repeat the dua Bismillahi arkik wa Allahu yashfik and then you can blow on the person on the affected area or on your hands and wipe the affected area or blow on some water and get the sick person to drink the water or wash the affected area with the water or you can blow on some oil and use the oil to massage the affected area now Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has said in the Quran وَنُنَزِّلِ الْقُرْآنُ مَا هُوَ شِفَى وَرَحْمَةٌ لِلْمُؤْمِنِينَ that in this Quran Allah has put mercy and healing for those who believe and it is the Sunnah of Muhammad Sallallahu to do Rukya in the way I have just demonstrated. So may Allah make it a mercy and a shifa for you and may it benefit you and heal those that you use it on. Amin. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah.